Did you know that caffeine doesn't actually give you energy at all? It actually tricks your brain into thinking you're not tired. It does that by impersonating a compound that signals your brain to sleep. That compound is called adenosine. It builds up in the brain the longer you're awake. Adenosine bonds with its receptor on brain cells, slowing them down and making you feel tired. Caffeine and adenosine have very similar structures, which makes caffeine the perfect imposter. Here's how it works. When you drink a cup of coffee or a can of soda, the caffeine gets into your bloodstream and makes its way to your brain. That's where it meets the adenosine receptor. Since caffeine and adenosine look so similar, the receptor cells happily bind the caffeine instead of the adenosine. Basically, the caffeine is stopping adenosine from slowing things down by taking its place. So your brain cells stop getting the slow down signals from adenosine. That boosts blood pressure and heart rate and keeps you alert. Of course, what comes up must go down. The receptors eventually let go of that caffeine, and that lets the adenosine back in. After about six hours, you're only going to feel half of caffeine's effects, and you're going to start to drag. So the next morning when you wake up, you're probably already feeling the early symptoms of withdrawal. That's why, in a desperate attempt to get things back on track, you reach for that cup of coffee.